Welcome everyone! In this video, I'll show you how to assign interactive worksheets and homework assignments from MozoBook and MozoWeb through Google Classroom. We'll use two books, a 3D scene, and a video, and share selected pages from the books, as well as the 3D scene and the video with students. I'll use the MozoBook teaching software and the MozoWeb site to show you how to add textbooks, 3D scenes, and videos to the virtual classroom. Let's get started. All you have to do is enter the virtual classroom and create the material. Enter a title. This time, the title will be Ancient Egypt. You can also add a description that provides instructions to students on how to progress with the material. Here are four instructions. Open the History and History of Arts book at, say, page 9, and read the relevant parts of it. Open the corresponding 3D scene, Tutankhamun's tomb, 14th century BC. Open the Architectural Marvels book at page 15, and read the relevant parts of it. Watch the related video, entitled, The Curse of the Pharaoh. You can also add the topic in the Topic field, History, Tutankhamun. You can then start adding the material. Select the Add Link button and choose the Link option. You can provide a link, which you can find on our MozoWeb page. So let's visit MozoWeb.com. On the MozoWeb page, search for the relevant history book with the search engine. Go to the right page to select and copy the link you need. Return to your GC page. Insert the link in the right place. Now you've successfully added your first educational material to your virtual classroom. Let's add the other book. Go back to mozoweb.com and search for the book. Type Architectural Marvels in the search field. Open the right page in the book to select and copy the link you need. Return to your GC page. Insert the link in the right place. Click on Add Link. Now you have another book in your virtual classroom. Students were also asked to open the 3D scene, so let's visit MozoWeb again. Click on the 3D menu item in the MozoWeb main menu bar. Type Tutankhamun's tomb in the search field. And there it is. Pull the mouse to the title and select the Copy Link Title option with a right click. Then, go back to your GC and add it to your lesson. Click on Add Link, insert the link, then click on Add Link again. We have all three attachments added to our virtual classroom. Now, only the video is missing. Similarly, copy the link from the page you need and paste it into GC. I can also add a link to a YouTube video. It's very simple to do. I just have to click on the Add button on the GC page as before, and then I select YouTube from the options. Then, I type Tutankhamun in the search field. When the search results appear, I just click on the video and add it by clicking on Add. Now, the virtual classroom is ready for publication. Click on the Post button to publish the material. Let's confirm that the students can see it and that everything is working properly. Go back to the GC main page and change your account by signing in as a student. As you can see, 
the students can see the material and the links that have been submitted. Let's click on them to see if they open correctly or not. Students have to log into their Moza web account to open the relevant section of the material. They can read the lesson and open the 3D scene and the video according to the teacher's instructions. Thank you for your attention. I recommend everyone watch our tutorial videos to learn about MozaBook and MozaWeb. If you need further information, please go to our website at mozaweb.com and scroll down to the page to find the Can We Help You menu item. Click on it and write to us at our customer support page.